Good morning. Good morning. Good We're morning. So good morning. Look at Deborah Dan, the vloggers. <laughs> no? I good morning, we're so glad you're here. Magic Kingdom vlog in forever. We daily vlog, so if you enjoy this video, come back tomorrow. Sarah's struggling with the... Are you struggling? Are you feeling good? I'm feeling good. I get to be creative again, and we were creative in our shots yesterday. I mean... Also, we forget that we got this lens, like, literally within a week, I think, of the pandemic starting. Yeah. So this camera, this lens so, has not seen a lot of part yeah. time. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Hopefully it looks as good as we're hyping it up to be. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go to this lunch. Yes. We got some melon mushroom pizza in a calzone. Picked it up. Picked up some few things at, at Walgreens. But we are ready to go and I'm gonna go home and work away my life. Yeah, here we go. So here is the calzone that I think one of you told us is really good. So Sarah got that. I don't know if we're splitting that or not. And there is a pizza. Eve wants some. Lots of veggies, vegan cheese, and half jalapeno. I love these cases. Funny thing is I went to Walgreens the whole idea of me leaving to go get this pizza started with the fact that I was going to go to run to Walgreens, grab coffee grounds, and then we talked about getting the mellow mushroom. So I go to Walgreens, I pick up some, some things like some fancy drinks for us, some shampoo, conditioner, saw Pepsi had a deal, so I got some Pepsi 12 packs. And then I leave and I'm going to a mellow mushroom and I'm pulling in a mellow mushroom and I realize I didn't even get the coffee grounds at Walgreens that I was supposed to. So that's a bummer, but we're going to eat some food. And we'll get to work, see how Sarah's feeling on this vlog. We got new girl on. Life is good. I feel like I have a park day hangover. We just really have not gone that hard at a park in a really long time. Even like when we would go during the week, it was always different when we went on the weekends because you're there for a longer time, the sun is out. Um, but yeah, we've just been working away today. Um, did you did you talk about how you're working all day today I don't think on so. the vlog? Um, so basically, Peter wants to get a project done before our staycation, so he won't have to bring his laptop at all. It's just automating something that he typically takes up time during his day every single day. So he's trying to get that done this weekend. I edited the Magic Kingdom vlog, and obviously there was way more to it than our standard home vlogs that we've been putting out for the past four months. So um, that took a little bit longer. Um, and yeah, I've just been hanging out and I cannot believe it's already after 5 p.m. Six. Six? 6.02. Six I practice three hours a day so that when I meet a pirate, I can kill it. We're watching the movie we wanted to yesterday. <laughs> Are you helping Peter work? He's working so hard. You helping him? How? Are you real? <laughs> what? Are you coming to attack me with kisses? So I just made us some tea. Peter has Christmas. I have lemon ginger. I think we should take this whole shindig. Switch over to a Christmas movie, even though I was kind of getting ready for a Pirates of the Caribbean movie marathon. I think because of the tea, we need to go Christmas movie. <laughs> the ginger tea that we have, it has been doing a really good job at helping my heartburn. Um, a lot of you guys gave great suggestions. My friend Britt also suggested a banana. That really helped her, so we got to get some bananas. Yeah, I mean, it kind of makes sense. Like, it is more of like a basic food um and bananas are like the best but i am going to try and stick with the tea um and more of like the natural things until i really can't handle it and then i'll move to something um like more medicine-y over the counter um but yeah that's really the biggest thing that's been going on right now is that everything gives me heartburn 
Peter chose Miracle on 34th Street. Also, while he's finishing up that, I am getting our blog post for the week up. I did not post yesterday. It's only week two and I already didn't deliver. Um, but it will talk about all of our dining reservations that we have for our staycation later this month. I will link it in the description below because I'll most likely make it live tonight so it'll already be live um, by the time this vlog goes up. So we have our cute Mickey and Minnie that we got in here. Um, also, we forgot to show this yesterday. We went to our P.O. Box and had this little gift from our friend Jackie. It's Stitch James' name on here. So stinking cute. Um, had to show that to you guys. I don't think I've really sat on this bed just yet. Um, but I want to talk to you guys about some exciting things that are happening this week. Um, not only are Megan and Katie Petrus arriving, um, they are moving here from Ohio, um, but we actually have some furniture being delivered. We didn't show my online shopping spree on the vlog, um, but things are coming. I decided on a different chair, which is great. I'm very happy with it. I know that we, I had talked about, um, being frustrated about like the chair taking a long time, the one that I originally wanted, but I was able to find one that matched the color and the style of that one, but was more of like a comfortable standard glider that we tried out when we were at Bye Bye Baby. Um, and it's arriving on Monday. So like, I, and I, I do not feel like I'm settling whatsoever. Um, definitely looks like the perfect hybrid of um of everything that we've looked at and what we wanted so that's really exciting um and then what's kind of funny is the other stuff we ordered isn't for the baby's room it's for our bedroom which i feel like is nesting in its own way like getting that situated um but we're getting a new bed frame we're getting side tables and we're getting curtains um and we'll just have to pick up a couple of frames and the hardware for the curtains um, and our room will basically be totally refreshed and complete. And so, um, that'll be super fun to transform this week. And then that like, really like the, uh, the last big thing that we need for the baby's room is a rug and for the crib and the mattress to arrive. And then like, it becomes fun. We get to do decorating and putting all of our little personal bits into it. Um, so the nesting continues. Here's what part of what I'm doing and I have been doing for about 12 hours now looks like. Super fun. I mean, for me it is, but for majority of the world, not fun. It's 11 o'clock and you guys remember, you guys remember, do you guys remember? My brain is fried. I've literally been programmed. I've been programming since, what time did I start? At 11? I've been like coding for 12 hours and I've got a whole other day tomorrow lined up, but I made good progress. It's like today was all like setting up the brains of it. Tomorrow's gonna be setting up like the buttons and the whistles and the things that make it look cool. Um, but I just, I have to stop now, which is actually a good thing so I can spend time with this little one. Um, but I have to stop because I have to start that database update that I run on the weekend so that my team doesn't have to. Yes. So after 12 grueling hours of coding and debugging and everything, I have to stop. Well, I mean, I'm running that, but that's like, I just start it and it runs and I make sure it doesn't break. So now we can like watch a movie or hang yeah. out or I kind of want a snack. I'm, I'm like, oh man, there's that metal mushroom and like it. Well, like we got not, a lot of stuff so we could eat it the whole day. But yeah. Like, but it, it wasn't like, like I'm, I think I'm like hungry. Yeah. yeah. Like hungry, hungry? Kind of. You could cook. We can get something. <laughs> oh. So I'm thinking I'm gonna go lazy route, just so we don't have to like actually cook something. I'm just gonna go pretzels and hummus. Just classic, maybe heat up a cup of joe. You never know. Ooh, that rhymed. She heard the rustles of the bag. I haven't been by you all day. Oh, you're such a sweet puppy. I'm, not, I'm just dealing with this hair right now because I don't wanna put a hat on. Because it's late and we're relaxing. <clears throat> Sarah unintentionally bamboozled us. What? Not really. We, we bamboozled us. Yeah, so the other day, Peter was going to, like, 
you started watching Crazy Rich Asians and I came out here and I was like, hey, you're watching this movie without me. We haven't watched it. And it was one of those movies that we had been meaning to see. It was finally free on something. I think it was HBO Max. And so I was like, okay, I'll wait for you. And then we went to go watch it tonight and it's gone. Yeah, we don't think it's anywhere. I think it's gone. Kaputs. Hmm. Ooh, all the Harry Potters. Yeah, but Harry Potters are like a recipe for you falling asleep. I would like a rom-com. Yeah. And Last Christmas is now on HBO Max. But on HBO Max is Crazy Stupid Love, which we like a lot. And we haven't seen that in a long time. Yeah. So maybe we should watch that. Is it going to keep you awake? Mm-hmm. I feel like we haven't actually watched it since our college program, which was nine years ago. <laughs> you are better than The Gap. I love The Gap, though. Me too. Um, it's almost one in the morning, and we're only halfway through this movie, but we're like... We're in it. And I forgot how crazy this movie is. I forgot how stupid this movie is. Yeah. I forgot But how... I love it. <laughs> <laughs> we always say that with Dom. Yeah. But I honestly don't think I've watched this since our college program. Mm-hmm. Um, There's so much. Like, I yeah. forgot so much of it. It's ridiculous. It used but... to be on TV all the time. Yeah. Like, when we watch TV at my mom's, um, Peter felt the baby. I felt, Yeah. I felt James really for like the first true time. Mm-hmm. Like Sarah all of a sudden was like, wait, wait, come here. And then it was like, pow! Twice. Twice, yeah, but the first one was huge. Yeah. So like, like it I, almost, it didn't hurt me, but it was like the first like uncomfortable kick. I felt James, I felt him. <laughs> he was like, hey dad, high five. We were trying just before that for a long time. For a long time, like, like 30 minutes. And he was like playing a trick on you. Yeah, and I like had to go help Eve with something and as I was going to help Eve before the movie, he was like boom, 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 boom. And Sarah's like, wait, 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 come back. And then he was playing tricks on me. But then I felt him like an hour into this movie. <laughs> oh gosh, this is how our puppy was sleeping. She looks so tired. <laughs> Ready for bed? That movie was crazy. <laughs> that movie was stupid. <laughs> um, I'm getting some new sunglasses. You sure are. You put in a claim. I put in two claims. So I was like, I've got like snazzy, crazy designs I like to run in. Mm-hmm. But like my everyday pairs have been get my two everyday pairs got scratched recently, and I didn't realize this. But you can do they have a one year claim on them, Look and at so me. oh gosh, I submitted a claim for two of my sunglasses yesterday. And I bought a third pair just in case those claims get denied. So I might, and what they do is they just send you the new lenses yeah. for a gooder. Mm-hmm. And I can't That's wait because it's That's a really good service. And for $25 pair of glasses. Yeah. Um, so I might end up having three new functional pairs soon. Ay, ay, ay. July 11th. I know of one duty, and that is to love Albert Camus. No big deal. It's only two in the morning. So I was just. We slept on the couch last night, and I'm so excited to sleep in a normal bed. That couch is comfy, but I slept on my back without covers. It was just... And the home, home renovation, yeah. I think, continues tomorrow, because I think we're supposed to get our blinds tomorrow, right? Curtains. Curtains, sorry, <laughs> curtains. Yeah, but we, we don't have the, the rod yet. But we, we could probably go on a little road trip to Ikea. It's just down the road yeah. to pick up the rod. Um, just so we can get another piece of our room ready and our rocking or glider chair for James's room is actually in Florida. It's in, what did I say? I want to say Alton oh. Springs, but it's not. It's it's Longwood, Long Beach. It's in Florida. It'll get here Monday. So it's probably, yeah. probably going to ship tomorrow from wherever it is to Orlando and mm-hmm. then on Monday morning go out for a shipment on yes. Monday morning. Oh, exciting things. It's, it's good, good to be home. home. She's very sleepy. Look at her paw around my finger. Come on, let's go to bed. Good night. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.